<laughs> Ask me why I'm laughing. I'm laughing because of the current stand of the, the rejection of the bill of restructuring by the zoo senate. Oh my God. <laughs> I will store them. 1-0 to IPOB. Niamodo, where are you now? I know you're hiding your face in shame. Eh? <laughs> I'll help you, Afra. I knew it. You see? Not even restructuring. You know, you know, it's like if they are if they Oh the zoo man. Thank God for Nam the Kano. Who saw this for a long time ago? Who saw this right handwriting on the wall and took took it upon himself to take his people away from this contraption, this rubbish contraption, you know? This rubbish contraption called the zoo, you know? Take us away from this place, you know? Take us away because we don't need to suffer with these people. We are not the same, you know? They have had their chance. Now is our turn. So all those idiots who want to use restructuring to confuse us, you know, like hocus pocus, now they can hide their face in shame, you know, knowing that they don't even want it. They want it the way it is. The zoo, they love it. It's their business place. It's their shop. It's their supermarket. So how can you come and restructure their supermarket so they don't get customers or what? You see? It's like, you know, a marketplace for all the criminals around the world. That's what Nigeria is. So restructuring it is, is spoiling business for them. You can see them, they're coming, all the vultures. They're speaking out, speaking up against the, the, the division of that zoo. But in the end, the zoo will dismember. There's nothing. Nothing is going to stop it. No matter how you try. Because when the head is off, the center cannot hold any longer. Everybody is tired. Even those who think they are Nigerianists, they are tired. Nothing is working. That's why I ask all the others who all the other nations comprising of the zoo to rise up. You can see now that we are meant to be slaves forever. You know, survival of the fittest. Is that how you want to live? Is that how you want to live, I ask? Can't you rise up? Revolution now. Revolution not today, not tomorrow. Because if you don't do it, Nobody's going to do it for you. I'm telling you the truth. That's the way it is. You can see it now. That they don't even want restructuring. So, why I'm happy about it is because all those who are going about trying to use restructuring to, you know, to calm us down, to derail our, our movement, now that they can go and hide their faces in shame. You know, the houses don't want restructuring the Northerns. The Senate have spoken, all the cabals have spoken because the, the Senate is speaking the minds of the cabals. This band, this fucking place, man, this mess called the zoo, you know, who that have killed millions of people because of this, the contraption have killed millions, millions have died because of this contraption. Still, the Western world are supporting it because they're making money out of it, you know. And the, the slaves are just keeping quiet, everybody. When you say they all attack you, you know, like uh, idiots. They don't know that it's them, you know. We're trying to save them from their, the mess they are in. And they don't even find out because you can, how can you save them when they know, they don't even know they're slaves, you know. They will come with, they will help their masters to attack you. You know, that's, that's, that's very, very, very unfortunate. 
It's very unfortunate, you know. Idiot going around talking about restructuring. <laughs> you can see that blatantly. No, <laughs> it is. It's not even going to to take a long time for them to say that. No, you know that's what they said. Can't you understand that? Nyongwood. Maybe I don't know where you are now. Whoever and the Oya or Hanes and Doshi and then them. You can, if you guys don't stop, you don't stop now. Then we start with you guys immediately. We don't have time to waste. We start wasting, yes, is destroying you completely, physically and, 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 and otherwise. You know, I thank you all for watching. You know, I just try to share this one, very little news, you know, and, you know, with all my, my friends and, and IPOB members who are resolute, do not give up. We are going to get there. You know, because, <laughs> oh my God, when I look at it, I just, I just, oh God, it's so, 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 so nice. So nice. Yeah. Just see, watch out, watch out this place first. You know, just watch out how a place is look like. Can you imagine? When our place can look like this if they allow us, but they they they, they would rather let us live in perpetual in perpetual poverty, you know, in a in a in a in a rubbish. You see this picture that is going around the internet, a place where there's waterlogged. The children are walking under inside inside. You know, so, so, see, see, that's the, these people need to be hanged. You know, they are wicked very wicked people you know they come here they see how things look like they enjoy it and they go home they just make money there and take it out there's too much money in that country in that place especially in biafra land they just come and take everybody take everybody take if not for the grace of chiku Abiyama, we could have all, all have gone down the only thing they want is just for us to start moving move anywhere you want to go go away just let them come and pick whatever they, they, is, they can pick you know you know they don't care about the people just make things nice do we ask for more make things nice you can steal as much as you want but now the door is closed you can't even steal anymore because we are our eyes is open this election will show them there will be no election in biafra land not only in an number state the whole of biafra land because they're all the same you know, none, none is different. So anybody that come out and say, oh, I will be different, no way, man. Only when we get Biafra and then we, put this, we take the bull by the horn, then we, we, we put the law, that the, how the laws will be. Every region will control their destiny. Then if you want to, if you want to, you know, survive, then you have to do that. I know. You know, now is the time. If you really want to survive, that's the time to do that. If not, <laughs> you are in for it. You are really, really in for it. You see? Just look around. You know, and I'm in a building complex. You know, just look around. Nice. Nice, everything. You know? We can do the same. We can do it. We can do it. Be clean. You know? You know, how do you think? We're living good here, but we need our place to be better than this. We have more money than they are. They even confess. They say it. They, are, they, they don't have it. The little they have, they put it into. And, they, 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 you know, if you make money and you don't grow the mo this money, if you don't multiply it, then you'll be poor, you know. <laughs> you know? They invest in, in things that matters. The health sector is powerful. Their education is power, everything, they make it nice, you know. But us, these people, it be, and the people doing it is not ordinary individuals. They should only wait and see if they, the people they elected, they don't do it, they would rise up. They, you will see them in the street. They don't waste time. They will be everywhere, writing every, until they do something. Because they know they have their mandate. But in our place, if we talk, you see what uh, this idiot, uh, David uh, Omar, awesome man, is doing. 
let him as I, I thought he's not afraid let him command the army to shoot one person again then uh, he will see what we will do to him we know we know we have their doors there everywhere we know where they are so we can get them when we want you know so they, they, they are just wasting their time they are wasting their time I'm telling you that hmm? just give me a minute give me a minute boy okay Oh. Thank you very much because I'm very busy right now. But I just want to share this with you because I love you guys, man. I love you guys. Don't mind all this. <laughs> the Yorubas, we do the war and the Arewas and all this revolt. Your leaders are not, no matter the, 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 the even, okay, I can say they, they make things good for you because the way Nigeria is, they make it good, but they're living better than you people. You people should revolt because even though you, are, you, have it, you think you have it all, we, dear friends, we are better off in terms of education, in terms of everything. Come to Biafra land, the, all the developments are individual development. Think about when the government will do just a little for us. Just all we need. But now it's too late. We are taking it by the bull by the horn. Then <laughs> we take the bull by the horn and do it ourselves. We know what to do. We know how to develop our place. So all these people jumping around, talking rubbish. If you are wise, being a Biafran, support what we are doing. It's for, it's for you and me. You know? It's for you and me. All right? It's to, to better our lives. The life of our unborn children.